So most people go by this measuring stick of net carbs, which means you subtract your fiber from your total carbs. And basically, fibrous carbs are not going to be digested. They're just going to pass through your gut and they're not going to raise your blood sugar. This is true. However, even if you find the, you know, carbs that have, you know, the low carb or the whole wheat or whatever they claim on there, it's all about this section here. So, I'm gonna, you know, I'm just going to put this on in post. Okay. The little ingredients section. So that'll actually tell you what the carbs are made of and what the carbs are made of is much more important than the total quantity of those carbs. Okay. So even if there's, you know, what is that? 20, 20 carbs and you know, 14 fiber or something like that. Even if there's 20 carbs, 14 fiber, and you know, only six of those carbs get through. If you are somebody who is new, six carbs of a very high glycemic variety, which by the way, whole grains are one of the, they have the, one of the most jacked up blood sugar responses that stays there. It sticks around. So even, you know, 10 grams or less of that type of carb is going to raise your blood sugar a bit.